Yo, what's good guys? It is your boy Jason JV saying welcome to another WWE 2K22 My Rise Vidya. And as y'all know, if you've been following, we are now on Monday Night Raw. And uh, we are about to confront Bailey about this whole intercontinental uh, title situation we got here now. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get right into this night thing. didn't see you there probably on account of all the distracting glare from this very shiny intercontinental championship title what's this all about ding dong hello i'm the first ever women's intercontinental champion man even for someone like me who already holds so many records it's pretty impressive i mean shit with that little ding dong noise you you, you did there you may as well say I mean, I, I, I'm just saying, if, you, if, you, if you're going to go that route, I mean, be fully committed to it. You know what I'm saying? Anyway. Right. And how exactly did you even win this? I don't remember hearing anything about a women's intercontinental champion in WWE. That's because it's not just for WWE, but for the entire world, you idiot. Hence the name of it, Intercontinental Anyway, I won it in an epic tournament in Rio de Janeiro against the best wrestlers from all the continents. It was so exclusive, cameras weren't even allowed. And when the final match was over, it was me, Bailey, standing over the decimated competition. I can still hear the roar of the crowd shouting my name, Bailey, the greatest of all time. In fact, I'm not only going to be the first ever women's intercontinental champion, I'm going to be the only women's intercontinental champion. No one will ever beat me. They'll actually rename it the Bailey Continental Championship. Has a great ring to it now that I think of it. She totally stole that whole, I can still hear the roar of the crowd shouting my name. From that old um, black and white promo that they aired before, um, or actually during WrestleMania 14. Who remembers that? I can still hear the roar of the crowd. Shouting my name. We were men of steel. You know what I'm saying, bruh? Bruh, let's go. Pretty confident about all that, huh? Why wouldn't I be? What? Are you going to prove me wrong? Mm, maybe. As a matter of fact, I am. I could use a little shine around my waist. Right? You probably could. But you won't. Don't worry. I'll take it easy on you. Ah, who am I kidding? I definitely won't. That's fine, because I don't plan on taking it easy with you either. Bailey's Intercontinental Championship. Let's do this. Hey, not to be impatient, but when am I going to get my Intercontinental title match with Bailey? It's been a hot second. Your Intercontinental title match with Bailey? What are you even talking about? She said she'd give me a shot. Yeah, but a shot at what? The championship she won a few weeks ago in Rio de Janeiro. Rio de Janeiro? Are you kidding me? That girl wasn't in Rio. She was off because her dog was getting a root canal. Just like Bailey to invent something fake. Bruh. Ugh, I knew it didn't all add up. Too bad, because... Despite the lies, it actually isn't a bad idea. But I guess it doesn't matter now. Bailey may be full of it, but you're right. Having a women's IC title is a good idea. It's about time, right? If only there were some kind of authority figure who could make it an officially recognized title. Hmm. Oh, wait, there is. Me. And since Bailey's already agreed to it, I see no problem with giving you a title opportunity. A real title opportunity. Oh, hell yeah. Wow, I guess people should invent titles more often, huh? Don't get any ideas. Damn. You know what? I like how um, Bailey's wearing the purple... The purple. Purple. Blah, blah, blah. Purple um, outfit while my girl's wearing the green. Got the Joker color scheme going on there. You know what I'm saying? Right, let's go. Bailey getting rocked. Let's go. Fly like the eagle. Oh, yeah. Oh, hell. 
No! What the hell? She stole that from Sonya. Get the hell off of me. Now. Now. Oh, hell no. Uh-uh. Now I'm offended. And I don't offend easily. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Nuh-uh, uh-uh. Screw you, okay? Screw you and the high horse that you rode in on. Little Miss High and Mighty. You little... Mm. Mm -mm. Get your ass up here. Oh, hell. Man, she got an answer for everything. No. Enough of your buffoonery. Get your ass up here. Now get your ass on up. Now, we go to school. Bam, baby! Let's go. Hand me down title or not, I don't care. My girl the new women's. I see champion. Let's go. Oh, this cannot be good. As the new women's intercontinental champion and the first superstar who actually won it, I'll be sure to do you proud, Mandy. I'm sure you will. Not so fast, ladies. What makes you think you're the intercontinental champion? I must have hit you harder out there than I thought. The match I just won, for starters. Oh, you won the match. But I guess you didn't read the fine print in the contract you signed before the match. It's an Intercontinental Championship, you dummy. Which means that just like the contract says, you have to beat three international superstars before beating me. Are you serious? Sorry, but I don't make the rules. What are you talking about? You made up this title in the first place, so you definitely made the rules. Mandy, tell her I'm champion. I actually have to side with Bailey on this one. Are you serious? Of course. She may have made this title up, but I made it official. And it was in the contract you signed. Superstars actually have to start reading those. To be fair, she probably doesn't even know how to read. Do you want me to read or fight? Is it so hard to do both? Geez, just beat three international superstars and then we'll talk. I'll make sure you get your opportunity with Bailey. And don't sass your GM. Yeah, and work on your reading skills. Uh, work on your people skills. Bitch! Loot ass press. Let's go. Spear! <laughs> and she's hungry for more. Get up. It's okay. Get up. Get up. Get up. Oh, hell. Oh, hell. Nope. Get out of here. I can't sanction your buffoonery. Get over there. Of course there'll be interference. By one of the most insecure. And I thought Charlotte was insecure. Ah, oh, hell. Nope. Come on, Alice, get up. Come on, get up. Now, as we were. Woo, yeah! Get your ass on up. Now. 
tap. Thank ya. See, it's Bailey. Everyone gets lucky sometimes, even Alice Anderson. She's still got a ways to go before she can rightfully challenge me for my IC championship. Alice responds, the more annoying you are, the more joy I'll take in beating you. Let's do this. Yeah! Come on, Natty by nature. Natty Caddy. Oh yeah. Okay, this whole Undertaker-esque interference is getting old. Yeah. Surprise! I actually hit that. Not gonna lie. And we gonna fly like the eagle in the sky. Fly like the eagle, so so really high. Yeah, I don't remember the words. Damn it. No. Get your ass over here. Ow. Damn it. We had the comeback too. We had it. Nope. Get your bratty ass down. Fucking natty bratty. Get your ass up. Stop calling you bratty by nature. Let's go. Get your ass on up. Time to end this. Finish her. Wait, that's not my finisher? She's breaking out of it. Oh, hail to the Nizzo. All right, get your ass on up. Now, it is over. Oh hell. Dress up. We are ending this right here, right now. See, wow, so Alice Anderson be a Canadian. That barely even counts as international. Same continent. Um, somebody tell Bailey, same continent? Intercontinental? I mean, technically, you know what I mean? If you think about it. Anyway. Uh, stop whining, Bailey. Uh, Natty by nature has a Canadian passport so it counts I've got one more win before I get to take you down in the ring again yes because that IC title is so nice that I don't mind winning it twice we we technically you know a former uh IC champ because we technically won that title whether baby wants to acknowledge it or not I don't care what that contract says but anyway Oscar let's go
Oh hell! No! Damn it! Come on, girl. Come on, girl. Get up. Get up. No. Woo. We barely escaped that by the skin of our teeth. Get your ass on up. Squash match. <laughs> Got her! Oh, cause Bailey has to interfere again. Of course. Clearly says Well, not when you pause it, but it clearly says win by pinfall or submission. So ain't that a bitch. Oh. Two thousand years later. Okay, can I finish this now? Cause I'm freaking tired of this nonsense. Come on, no sell, no sell. Thank you. Damn it! Screw you! Get your ass up there! Since you want to fly off the corner so bad, I'd be happy to help you! Alright, now we're gonna squeeze the life out of you and end this shenanigan. Now we done. <clears throat> Here is your you're full of it, Bailey. But I did what your so-called contract asks. Three international superstars defeated. Shall I ask Mandy to set the title match, or would you like to do the honors? As much as I hate to admit it, I am impressed. Congratulations. You know, I've said it from the start. This Intercontinental Championship is a very prestigious title. After all, I hold it. But you've done the work, so I'll talk to Mandy. Wait, so you're really not going to try to weasel out of this? What kind of champion do you think I am? Are you serious? After all, you fulfilled the requirements of the contract exactly. And you know how much I respect official championship contract law. Yeah, right! Right. Oh, but speaking of, there is one thing I forgot to mention. Since it is an international title, you know how when you apply for your passport or a visa, there's a waiting period before you get it? Yeah, the title contract actually also specifies a lengthy waiting period before we can set up the match you qualified for. Oops! kidding me no you're probably actually serious aren't you mm-hmm uh, don't worry it'll go by fast I mean by the time the waiting period is over I'll have probably broken the record as the longest reigning intercontinental champion ever male or female but to you it will seem like the blink of the eye I mean heck I guess there's a chance that you might not even be in WWE by then so I don't know. Feel free to send me a card or something, or congratulate me on social media since you'll be retired. Hashtag longest reigning IC champion sounds good. Thanks. Can't wait to hear from you then. To it all. Four hundred fifty-five days late there. Today is a day that will surely be mentioned in all the effusive speeches when I. Bailey am inducted into the WWE Hall of Fame because in just a few short moments down to the exact minute when I first won this little beauty here I will become the longest reigning intercontinental champion not for the women not for the men but for all of WWE for all time
You idiots said I couldn't do it, but you know who never doubted me? Me! So let's join in and count down to the moment of my glory. It's only 20 minutes to go. You gotta be kidding me. I'm gonna be back in about 19 minutes. 1959, 1958, 1957, uh. 1956, 1955. Are we really doing this? 1954. Come on, I can't hear you. 1950, 1949. Uh. 1948, 1947. Yes, thank you. Mm. I don't think I could have made it through that. Oh, snap. It is a momentous day. But not because you're going to break any records. Guess who's waiting period just ended? And that's fitting, because tonight is going to be a night of endings. Your intercontinental title reign is ending too. Right here, right now. Let's do this. Let's do this. Two time IC champ, let's go. Oh, Spear! No, cut! Nope. You get up when I want you to. Let's go. Squash match! <laughs> Your title reign was a joke! <laughs> Two time, two time, I see champ. Intercontinental champion, Alex Thunder Anderson. Let's go. I still can't believe it. There you see our new champion. Tonight is definitely a night to celebrate, but let's not lose sight of the fact. And there it is. Story complete. Bailey's Intercontinental Championship. And we gain just shy of 7,000 fans. Let's go. Alright y'all, I think that'll do it for this video. Actually, you know what? Let's let's see if we can squeeze in one more. Let's 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 talk to Tasia. Natalia was here earlier and got upset when I kept making nautical jokes. <clears throat> Cause she's the boat. <laughs> Get it? I thought it was pretty funny. But she didn't and threatened to have me kicked out. Think you could see if there's anything you can do about that? Several bad puns later. I see what you did there. Yep, I see what you did there. <laughs> Let's go. Come on, Brady by nature. We got her. Hook, line, and sucker fish. Better than the boat. Story complete. We got, again, just shy of 7,000 more fans. And we got, you know, five bonus attribute points to aerial offense. Which is nice. And uh, let's see here. Let me check social media right quick. Let's see. Nat by Nature says, First I lose to Alice Anderson and now I keep getting tagged online with jokes about uh, maritime law and dolphins. You know, BOAT is an acronym for best of all time. Yeah, well. You, you set yourself up with all these nautical jokes. I'm just saying. See, Mandy Rose, uh, congratulations to Raw's newest Intercontinental Champion at Alice Anderson, uh, who not only bested Bailey, but some very complicated contract contractual requirements. Uh, after discussions with WWE management, the decision has been made to remove those contractual requirements moving forward. The, IC, the women's IC title 
will be subject to normal WWE protocol as it pertains to title defenses. Yeah. Damn it. Anyway. Uh, Carmella, I can... I see everyone talking about Alice Anderson's win, but my takeaway is that new championship is now in the mix. Uh-huh. Oh, Edge. So it's about time the women's division has an intercontinental champion. Congrats to Alice Anderson. Oh, thank you, Edge. Becky Lynch. Seems like... Bailey is a little scared of Alice Anderson. Facts. <clears throat> All right, y'all. I think that'll do it for this video. Uh, we'll touch on some more stuff come the next video. So with all that being said, it is your boy, Jason JV. Reminded y'all to don't forget to like, comment, and of course, subscribe if you haven't done so already. <clears throat> and also don't forget to check out, of course, all the links in the video description down below. And uh, yeah, till the next one, y'all have a blessed one. All right. Peace.